A Japanese university student has created his own humanoid robot for a graduate project, and it's a twin of Yuki Kashiwagi, a singer from the hugely popular Japanese girl group AKB48. Shown off at the Niko Niko Chokaigi Super Conference in Tokyo, the Yukirin robot depicts Kashiwagi in a long white dress, and an Xbox Kinect sensor built into the chest of the robot reacts to humans nearby, so that the robot turns and fixes her gaze on anyone that enters her field of vision. According to Japanese website IT Media Japan, student Takayuki Toto says that he carved the robot's face out of soft wood by looking at magazine photographs. He intends to upgrade the robot with better head tracking, eye pupils, and more expressive eyelids. Toto admits that the resemblance of the robot's face to the real idol is not 100% perfect, and he has designed the facial resemblance from photos and magazines and various meetings such as events in real time. Despite being very creepy, this robot is an impressive achievement for a student working alone. Chinese company Fourier Intelligence has unveiled an updated version of its robot Fourier GR1 and released a new video featuring the robot acting as a physiotherapist. However, the video does not specify whether the robot's movements are controlled by an operator or artificial intelligence. Judging by the information provided, it seems to be an operator, as the company has only stated that the robot is capable of autonomously navigating complex terrain and avoiding obstacles. The company also claims that it is an ideal physical agent for general artificial intelligence, but it appears that the AI for the robot has not yet been developed. In the future, the GR1 will be used in medical facilities, such as assisting immobilized patients in getting into bed or wheelchair. The GR1 can maintain balance while walking and perform various tasks, as stated by Fourier Intelligence CEO Zen Ko. The robot can be programmed to sit, stand, or jump, use utensils, and operate various tools. This can set up the GR1 to work as a home assistant or rehabilitation program assistant, as well as serve as a companion for lonely elderly individuals. Engineers have created the world's first silicone robot doll with artificial intelligence. It cries when hungry, wants to sleep, seeks comfort, needs a diaper change, and can feel discomfort. Essentially, it's an artificial child created by scientists that simulates a real baby. This silicone robot doll was created by sculptors from the Spanish company Babyclon. The company was founded by hyper-realistic sculptor Cristina Iglesias. Babyclon manufactures dolls that visually resemble real babies to the maximum extent, although they are not robots in the conventional sense. According to the Babyclon website, the company positions its infants more as avatars and animatronics, which can be characterized as robotic moving babies. The new toy models created with artificial intelligence have several new features. For example, they stop crying when you give them a pacifier. High-quality surgical silicone, which closely resembles human tissue in terms of hardness, elasticity, and weight, is used in the manufacturing of the doll. None of the stages of doll creation take place at a factory. They are entirely handmade. Engineers from the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology in Zurich are not giving up on turning their wheeled robot animal into a fast and agile delivery robot. In the latest tests, the robot had to navigate through a complex urban landscape, and it seems to be handling all types of surfaces and terrain easily. Perhaps in the future, we will see an army of such delivery robots on the streets of our cities. Animal overcomes obstacles using a trial and error method. It assesses the obstacle and chooses a way to overcome it. The machine can climb over it, jump over it, crawl under it, or apply any combination of movements that have worked in the past. The creators of the robot have taken a comprehensive approach to its training, combining the previously implemented project's software control and machine learning technologies. The movements of the self-learning robot are surprisingly graceful and efficient, setting it apart from most similar machines. Machine learning algorithms help animal assess the landscape and navigate it, the robot flexibly applies a library of movements as needed, which is constantly expanding. This helps the machine confidently maneuver on uneven and slippery surfaces. Japan's Chukyo University and AIST demonstrated a dual-arm robot performing a Japanese tea ceremony at a press preview for the SeaTech Electronics trade show in Chiba. The key new technology is the recognition of the functions of everyday items. Everyday items such as cups and spoons have functions that are evoked by their shapes, 
such as small indentations for scooping and large indentations for storing water. The robot recognized the type, position, and function of the tea utensils in front of it, such as teaspoons and ladles, and made tea without detailed programming in advance, such as determining which utensils to grasp and how to carry them. When humans see a cup for the first time, we can instantly identify it as a cup. However, in order for the robot to do this, it needs to use approximately 300 cups to make it aware of what a cup is in the first place. The lawns of Indian Institute of Technology in Kanpur recently witnessed a unique encounter when real dogs encountered a robotic dog. This intriguing event took place during IIT Kanpur's annual tech festival Tech Kriti, and a video capturing the moment has gone viral on YouTube. The video, shared by Dr. Mukesh Bangar, founder and CEO of Mooks Robotics, the company behind the innovative robot dog, shows a curious stray dog cautiously approaching the robotic canine. The robot equipped with advanced AI responds playfully, even flipping onto its back in a gesture that mimics real dog behavior. The interaction attracts the attention of other stray dogs who join in, circling the robotic newcomer, trying to understand its presence in their territory. The real dog, though a little apprehensive, tries to playfully engage with the robotic dog as the latter tries to reciprocate its moves. Meanwhile, other dogs are also seen trying to figure out the presence of a new dog in their territory as they circle the duo. The video left internet users amused, with many posting an array of comments. While some were thrilled to see the amazing amalgamation of technology and reality, others hailed India's advancements in robotics. Introducing the world's first soccer-playing robot dog, the Dribblebot, developed by MIT, can play soccer on grass, mud and sand. The team of developers has prepared their creation for RoboCup, a major international competition founded back in 1996. But why prepare a four-legged robot for a football championship and teach it ball handling skills? It might seem like a huge investment of time and resources for a simple game. However, the developers disagree. They believe that soccer is an excellent opportunity to test the robot's movement skills, agility and decision-making ability. During the game, the machines receive additional training and undergo testing. It is especially important for the robot to be ready to move not only on parquet surfaces, but also on grass, sand, mud, and snow. Football training helps to develop these skills. While Dribblebot can't yet be called a perfect robot, it plays soccer quite decently, but stairs and inclines still pose a problem for the small robot dog. Introducing Auto Agri, an autonomous futuristic robot cart, created by Norwegian engineers. The robot transports implements weighing up to 2,000 kilograms, positioned behind the front wheels. All four wheels, placed at the corners of the machine, are driven and can turn 360 degrees. This gives Auto Agri additional maneuverability, the ability to move in all directions, and even to rotate around its axis if needed. Like many similar developments, this robot is fully electric, but there is also a hybrid option available. In this case, the manufacturer adds a 60-horsepower diesel engine. The robot combines power and eco-friendliness, significantly reducing emissions, with the electric model allowing for zero-emission farming. Designed for autonomous operation using GPS and sensors, it ensures precise operation at any time of the day. It promises to reduce soil compaction and offers adaptable compatibility with existing agricultural equipment, making it an ideal choice for modern farming. Write in the comments which of the robots shown in this video impressed you the most. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Caro Show channel. Also check out our previous videos. See you next time.